If I had to restart my SMA in 2024, I'd do these four things as soon as possible. In fact, I have a fifth extra free bonus tip for those of you who stick around until the end of this video. And if you're wondering, well, why do I have the authority to talk about this? Well, I've got over 15 years of working with startups and billion dollar companies. And I've got over four years of running my own six figure social media marketing agency. But enough about me, let's jump straight in to tip number one. If I were to start my SMA in 2024, I'd give a lot more importance to offering great service than just adding more clients. Personal connections, they make businesses thrive and here's why. So a man Gadzi says, when you start your agency, hire someone straight away from Artwork that can actually manage your service delivery. I think this is all wrong. You should do the opposite. You should actually perform the service delivery yourself, entirely yourself for at least your first five clients. And this way, you know how to actually deliver great service. Then you hire someone, you show them what to do, and you'll be able to keep an eye on them and see if they're better than you, if they're actually delivering service the best way. Honestly, Mangadzi tells you to hire someone straight away. Don't do that. Do the service delivery yourself. Learn as you go along. There's plenty of resources on YouTube. Honestly, it's going to help you out. This is what I would do. This is a mistake that I did. When I first started, I hired someone. Instead, I would focus on the service delivery myself. Also, being good at service delivery yourself helps you communicate on sales calls. And when you give great service delivery, your clients are going to tell others about you. In the long run, this means more money for you and less stress because you know what works and what doesn't. And your client's gonna be more satisfied and a satisfied client really is your best advertisement. So building rapport and trust with each client ensures that they come back and guess what? They're sending you referrals. Tip two, if I had to restart my SMA in 2024, guys, I'd really improve my persuasion skills. There's power in words and that power can be harnessed. A big move that you'd wanna make is sharpening your persuasion abilities. Here's the simple truth. The top folks in sales, they've got a gift. They talk in a way that's smooth and make others nod in agreement. It's not just about saying words, but about making those words count and sway decisions. So if you become one of those who can chat and convince with ease, your sales calls will shine brighter and you're gonna make a lot more money. So think of honing this skill as adding a powerful tool to your kit. Not only will you communicate better, but you'll also see more folks eager to work with you. It really is like sprinkling magic onto your conversations. Confidence in your words can transform a maybe into a yes. The way you present your arguments can make or break a sales deal. Step three, if I were to restart my agency in 2024, I'd become more disciplined and replicate what the 100K per month person actually does. Guys, success often leaves clues and discipline really is one of them. Imagine someone making 100K a month. What's their secret? It's discipline. It's like planting seeds in the garden. The more you care and the more time you give, the better the plants grow. It's the same with pets. It's the same with everything. So first off, wake up early. You're gonna wanna enjoy the sun getting up early. This gives you a head start. Next, focus on tasks that re generate revenue. Think of these as the big plants in your garden. So you gotta water and care for them a lot more. Take care of yourself too. Get enough sleep. Just like plants, they need rest. Eat good fuel to fuel your body. Again, just like plants, they do need the right soil and exercise to stay strong and sharp. And don't forget your brain, guys. Reading feeds it new ideas. By copying the habits of those who succeed, you set yourself on a path to join them. They've paved a road that you can drive on. Routines become habits and habits forge success. Step four, if I were to restart my SMA in 2024, I'd reach out to more leads and higher quality leads. Reaching out can be daunting, I know it is, but that's where the magic happens. For the longest time, 
I was reaching out to such a low amount of leads. Then I increased my outreach, but I was still focusing on lower quality leads. Honestly, I think this is all due to a limiting mindset that I could never actually work with a high quality client. It was only when I started reaching out to high quality clients that my results started going from being respectable to really being impressive. So guys, aim high and see the difference in your journey. Broadening your horizons can really lead to unexpected, fruitful partnerships. And here's the secret bonus tip. If I'd restart my SMA in 2024, I'd execute over learning. Guys, learning is essential, but most spend hours, too many hours on YouTube trying to get free information. Instead, just get a mentor to save you time. Action speaks louder than theory. The right mentor can accelerate your journey, guiding you away from common pitfalls. Don't forget to subscribe because I've got some really special content coming up soon just for subscribers. So smash that subscribe button and I'll see you all in the next video.